We are under a frost advisory, all of us across central Illinois, from 2 a.m. to 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. Reason being, have you ever wondered why frost forms? Well, we have the perfect conditions for it. We need cold temperatures. It's the three C's. Cold temperatures, clear sky, calm winds. When those temps are near or below 32 degrees, the water vapor in the atmosphere is able to cool and condense. And because it's so cold, it condenses into ice crystals instead of those water droplets. Also, we need to be under a clear sky. Reason being, the clouds, they act as space heaters when the, it's called radiational cooling, when the ground cools at night. All of that radiation goes back up into space, and if there's no clouds, nothing is keeping it trapped into back near ground level. So we have that. Not only that, later on tonight, yes, it's been breezy today, but winds do die down overnight tonight as well. So now you know why we are going to have that frost across much of central Illinois as you wake up tomorrow morning. Looking pretty gorgeous out there. Definitely a different scene from this time yesterday. Blue sky, a lot of sunshine. On a chilly note though, live Doppler 3D Max not tracking anything in our neck of the woods. Most, if not any of that wet weather is off to our east right now for parts of northwestern Indiana. I mentioned it is much cooler temperatures. These are most of our highs for the day. Mid 50s, so really not too impressive. Very chilly for this time of year, about 15 degrees below where we should be. Those winds, yes, breezy now, coming out of the north at a good 510, some spots even 15 miles an hour, but it will die down later on tonight. Nothing really to show you today on Nestler and Associates, but see these white little streamlines? If you squint really closely, there they are right there. They start to die down tonight. I just wanted to show you that, yes, those winds will become calm later on tonight into the morning hours. Nothing in the way of precipitation really through the rest of this week as high pressure dominates our weather pattern. So with that here in Decatur, we will be at 35 degrees as our overnight low temperature. Under that frost advisory, bring your plants inside. Bring them in now so you don't forget tonight. You can always cover them. I just like to be safe and bring them in. That way I can avoid them being damaged at all costs, those winds. Again, calm, it will be clear and very cold later on tonight, the coldest of the season thus far. That frost will clear up as that sun begins to rise. As you head out on your Monday, grab the jacket. It will be very chilly. Temperatures only topping out in the middle 60s for your Sunday. St. Mary's Hospital seven day forecast after a pretty chilly, uh, I guess a little bit warmer than today, but a cooler Monday, I should say. We definitely start to warm up feeling more like summer. Tuesday and Wednesday, cold front comes through. It will be breezy. A lot of sunshine, as I mentioned, with that high pressure could be feeling more like summer as opposed to fall by this time next weekend.